God's Grace and World Prayer for a Total Global Change, Part 1 of 6 on Between Master and Disciples, held in English. The world is a circle without a beginning And nobody knows where it really ends Everything depends on where you are In the circle without a beginning Nobody knows where the circle ends La 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 Hello guys Hello, Hello master. 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 Can you hear me? Yes, yes, yes we can, Master. Because I already had to turn on the loudspeaker. Oh. oh. You hear well or not? Yes, 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 yes master. master. Very well. Okay. I have to be among people. Not like living with them, but nearby. I think so. I cannot be too loud. Okay. Hey, how are you guys? Is better today? We are master. good, Master. Good, Master. Thank you. How are you, Master? Uh, I'm good, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> good to hear. That's good. I just uh, have solved some problems. It's been a long time, many months. And oh. A lot of trouble and prolonging problems. I just finished one section. And uh, what next? <laughs> many more sections, of course. <laughs> uh, you guys are sleeping a little bit better today. Yesterday, you had to help people move. And it was so late all night long, but we had no choice, okay? Understand, yes, master. master. I was also awake with you. You know that, right? Yes, yes Master. Yes. Because I keep calling you until the end. Until you end it. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Meaning until the night ended. <laughs> 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 the night did end, yeah? Uh, eventually. And uh, thank you for helping others, okay? Huh? You're yes, welcome, master. master. What to do? We yeah, sometimes don't have any choice of uh, what we do. Understand, Master. To help others is to often have no choice. Have no choice at all. I want you to tell me some good things. Not always mm, bad news or I have to tell you. Is there anything good? Yes, yes, master. yes, master. yes master. Yes, Master. Yes. If not, also good. That means I just say goodbye and... You know, <laughs> it's good for me. Yeah, I also want to sleep a little bit, but I didn't have a chance today. No, oh. too much work. Mm. The follow-up of the work, you have delivered and you're done, but uh, it's not done for me. Right. You know, right? Mm. Yes, Master. Yes, Master. But I'm happy that you help, because that part I cannot do. Right, Master. That part you have to. I can't drive. I don't know where to drive, and I don't know how. <laughs> so it's very, very good that you helped yesterday to drive people and things. God bless them. Huh? Okay. Tell me, is there anything good? Or I just good night then? Huh? Uh, some good things? Yes, there are some stories as well, Master. Tell me, tell me. Quick, quick. Regarding past lives, I was told a story about a bird and a worm. The bird met the worm in one of their past lives and they became a human couple in this lifetime. Ah, is that a true story? Yes, it's a true story. They are my parents. Who is the worm? <laughs> I think it's my father. <laughs> uh huh. And my mom is the bird. One bird and one worm. Oh, the bird ate the worm and had to come back, right? Yes. Together? Yes. Oh, poor worm and poor bird ate the wrong worm. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, I could see that. Maybe your mother looks, you know, chubby like a bird, yeah? Well-fed bird. <laughs> and your father slender and tall like a worm. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe an a worm, huh? Yeah. Yes. But he's good-looking for a worm, don't you think? Yes. He was, yeah. And very gentlemanly, very good. I think uh, your mother was a more active one, huh? The more controlling one, huh? Yeah, and your father yeah. is always, okay, dear, okay, dear, right? Yes. <laughs> you win, you win. <laughs> oh, how do you know that? Um, They told me this story. Who told you? Your mom or oh, your dad? Yeah. yeah, my mom saw the past lives Oh. and shared the story. And there are two questions. Uh-huh. 
how can we know our own past life? And how does the bond between people work life after life? Oh, wow, it's complicated. Some people, when they practice a lot, they have a different kind of extra um, bonus. Many of the Buddha's disciples knew some of their past lives. The Buddha knew many, many past lives, not just his, but uh, his uh, monks and his other disciples as well. Yeah, So that's why I read you many, many Buddhist stories, because the Buddha told about the past lives of this and that and other people. Yeah, remember? Yes. And the past lives, I don't worry about the past lives. What for do you remember the past life? You can't change anything. <laughs> I will tell you about a past life, okay? Yes, Master. My own past life stuff. <laughs> oh, cool. oh, yes. yes. One of the lives. You know, I've been feeding the, the world people. I told you, right? Yes, yes Master. Yes. They came to my house and they even wanted to come into the house. The cat person even from anywhere just came and then told me open the door, you know, and not not loud but inside. So I opened the door and he or he just wanted to go in. I said, no, 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 I can't. No, can't, can't. I don't know how to deal with it right now. I'm very busy and it's not the place that I can have a zoo here. And fox people and all kinds of bird people came. Wow. And I, I fed them. Remember? I told you that. Yes, yes, yes sir. It's a mini zoo, huh? okay? And <laughs> 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 but I don't let them in. I say you can stay in the garden or come and go. But you don't stay too long either because other people might think I seduce you and make you stay here and then they will be bothered or jealous and they will make trouble. So when you see feeding, you eat and then you leave, okay? All right, that's good. All right. Okay, this is very simple, but then the prominent ones are the Tigol people. They always come and tell me these good things and, oh, be careful with that thing and stuff like that. The cat person also wants to tell, and the folks and the other birds, people, small birds, big birds, and even spider people. If the big cannot come in, the small come in. <laughs> can you get through the gap of the windows? Or the gap under the door. They tell me every day a lot of stuff, but mostly similar things or all the same thing, you know, important things. So I say, okay, okay, I heard it already. And even the dog people from the far away neighbors also keep trying hard to tell me, trying so hard to let me know. The dog person's voice, even far away with all the windows closed, you still can hear him. Wow. You know, the voice very high. Oh, oh, oh. you know, yeah. <laughs> And so about these seagull person, there are different stories from all different animal people. But I should tell you one seagull person that I remember today. Yes, please. Yes, Master. Yes, master. Thank you, Master. The other maybe another day. Okay. One day I had some questions about some bothering kind of feeling or kind of attached feeling from somebody. I didn't really ask anybody. I was just, ah, yeah. Why all this trouble for me? Just leave me alone. And then the king of the seagull of people of that area wow. Wow. came and told me and said, oh, it, it, it's not you, it's not uh, that person. It's the word karma that projects in this way to you, to trouble you. Oh. I said, okay, okay, I kind of guessed it already. It's always word karma, word karma. It's like a mantra they can tell me. <laughs> and then I said, who are you anyway? Yeah, he said, I, I am, uh, now I forgot his name. I can't believe that. <laughs> Just one moment. Oh, Neil. His name is Neil. Yeah. So I said, spell it for me. He spelled it like N-E-O. I said, oh, oh. oh. are you a new, new one, huh? Or uh, have I not known your name before, huh? He said, no, no, you knew my name. I am that king of the seagulls in this area. I said, oh, but last time when you first came, you introduced yourself to me. Your name is N-U. You, you know? Yeah. Yes. I said, yeah. He told me, ah, it sounds the same. So I made it short and simple <laughs> for you. <laughs> <laughs> he made it short and simple. So I said, ah, yeah, yeah, I got it now. You know, N-E-O and N-U. It, it sounds the same, like new. Yes, 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 master. I even asked him, is it new or is it new? Is it new? 
And that second time when I asked, who are you? That tells me this and that. So he spelled his name it actually is N-E-O. But it's really pronounced the same, right? Neo. Yes. Yes. Yes, yes ma'am. Neo, more or less, huh? Okay? <laughs> <laughs> so I said, okay, okay. All right, so why are you so kind to me? He's so good. He said, because uh, you're helping us, you know, through some cold days, and we're very appreciative. I said, oh, it's my pleasure. I love to do that. I love to do that. Let me remember, okay, <laughs> the front and the back, the beginning and the end. Let me remember the sequence of the conversation, huh? I know yes. the whole thing. It's just, I want to tell you the way it was, yeah? Understand? Yes, yes, yes master. And... Not like after what said, oh, oops, that was at the <laughs> beginning, and that was <laughs> <Yeah, you know. laughs> uh, I often do that, yeah, forgive my old age, okay, yeah. All right, so uh, what was it then? I said, okay, you are so kind to me, I thank you anyway, but is there anything else you want except what I give, you know, every day? I bread and mix with some fruit, but do you have any kind of preference? Something else that I don't know about your kind of food. He said, that's okay like that. I said, do you like fruit? Any special food? He said, no, we don't. Because some days they don't come and uh, the food is left over until the next day. I worry it's not fresh. So I asked him if it's still okay like that. I can't just crawl out onto the roof and pick out <laughs> the one piece at a time from the bread. Because I chop it into a cube, you know, small cubes. Like small finger size of kips, yeah? Yes, yes, yes master. I say, if you don't eat it fresh, I can't go out and, and pick it up, okay? Pick one by one like that. He said, no, is this still okay? Uh, we eat worse than that. I said, what? I remember some days before that, when they didn't come, I asked you, oh, why didn't you guys come yesterday? What happened? Do you have some better food somewhere else? Or somebody fed you? They said, no, no. I said, then what did you eat? He said to me, trash. Oh, wow. it, it, oh. it was terrible for me. I felt like a pin just pin to pick my skin. I said, I would not eat trash myself. Why do you have to eat trash? And the fox also, also sometimes reported to me the same thing. If he didn't come and eat the food I put outside, he said, yeah, eat trash. Oh. And I felt so terrible. I felt so sorry. Imagine if we had to eat trash. Yes, yes, master. master. So I asked him just kind of the same as I asked the folks person. Well, how do you get trash to eat? I felt so terrible, felt so sorry, you know, that they had to eat trash to survive. So I asked the folks person, how do you do it? Because mostly nowadays people cover the trash. How did you get in and eat? How did you open it? He says some trash cans are closed. Some trash cans are open. So. He just eats whatever is open. And when we are full, we don't come to eat your food. I said, okay, I know that now. So I will still continue feeding you. And if you don't eat, then you can eat next time, okay? Otherwise, I thought you don't like the food and you might not come again. And so the fox people, they like fruit. There were two of them. They like fruits, but not all kinds of food. They like pears. Papaya, <laughs> 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 uh, things like that. Oh. But like apple, uh, they didn't really like it too much. The bird people, if I chop them very fine, they're very fine. Then they eat them. Although after all the bread is gone, they had no choice. They eat them too. They're good for you. Eat the food also, okay? <laughs> 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 and I always tell them to thank God. And uh, they also thank me. And just because you think you're small And doesn't mean you're just small at all It hath been written, Thou shalt not kill. 
If any hate and desire to slay, they are guilty of the law. Yea, if they cause hurt or torture to any innocent creature, they are guilty. The Gospel of the Holy Twelve, it seems.